So guys, we're back out magnet fishing again. We're at a new spot today. Uh, we've never fished this place. Um, it looks a really, really good spot by the looks of things. So yeah, we're gonna see what we can find. Uh, we apologize in advance for any wind noise. We're not quite sure how bad it's gonna be yet, but everything is blowing around and uh, it's quite high winds. So yeah, um, we'll see what we can find anyway and we'll bring you back when we find something. Oh look, it's the same door look. Oh look at that, look, it's got gold on the handle. Dad, look at this. Oh yeah. Look at the handle. That's a really old tray. Look at the handle. That's oh, amazing. Look at look this. Look. This is a hand. I love this. Samuel. That's great. Oh, it's got like a brass hand for the handle. Samuel Withers and Co Limited. Bromwich, West Bromwich. What are these there? Look? Are they coins? Yeah, that's the key. That's that key. Oh, that's the scotching look to the keyhole. Yeah, it is. Oh, that would have been the handle there. Wow. That's amazing. Hey, yeah, look. Put that in the trolley. We'll take that home. I want that. Yeah. I love this bit. I love that handle. <laughs> that's great. That's amazing. I want that. Keep that, put that in the trolley. <laughs> can you check it up? Oh, Dad, can you get that off? Oh, look what I've got. Crowbar. That's a beauty. Nothing wrong with that. That'll clean up. Like new. That's all the lock mechanism. Or is that is that might be another one, or it might be the inside. Think, I think that's part. I of think that, that went time. behind the door. Yeah, it did. That's the back side of it. That's the back of the door. The lock mechanism. If we find a key, just remember it'll be the one to that. Because <laughs> there would have been a spare key in it. Yeah, that's good, isn't it? Oh, yeah, that's good. I think that's break off a bike and a hinge. A couple of bits of little light hooks. Got a thing. Into the middle, like a cigarette lighter up. Uh, that. And bearing in mind, this magnet is still sticking to that really strong, even though it's got all that on it. Just a piece of tube. Something like 19th century. Get a real good one. It's a bigger version. What? Father, that's where my Land Rover exhaust went. Is it a Land Rover one? Just pulled this out, it's just some hinge off it. Big old door, I think. That would have been attached to this. This is part of the door. Quite a fancy one here. It's all blacksmith made, that was. Quite old. On to the next one. Oh, 
expensive. Oh, Kango bit. A what? Very expensive. It's a Kango hammer. Well, like a jackhammer? Yeah. Oh, right. Kango spike. <gasps> no, that, I thought that was an hand grenade then. No, that's a solenoid off a starter motor, isn't it? Oh, I, yeah. I actually thought that was a hand grenade. Like, it, like it, it flipped round on the magnet and it sort of showed that side. And that feeling when your heart sinks in your chest. Like I thought I was going to blow up then. Not even joking. Go on, Dad. Oh yeah, unicycle. Go on then, get on it. <laughs> How does that work then? It's half of a scoot. Oh, I think it is a scooter, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Like that. Well, we'll that. Doesn't look a modern one, it's probably 1960s, 70s. Quite old then. It's big. I don't know what it is. Want something out. And something out. In the way. Come on. What have we got? The thing with this magnet is it just picks everything up. Like we've got a big mooring pin here, look. Dad, I think that's a mooring pin, isn't it? There we go. Lock. Another one of them. Yeah, that's it. That's an old lock. This it's got a brass. Got a nice door. brass handle on there. Old door I've lock. Hinge. I've got the hinge, you've got the lock look. Come on. You know what? Some things are just impossible to get off. Right. Yeah, that's a hinge lock. Hinge would have set on that and it would swing open. Oh, is that a different one? Is that a different place? Oh, you've got the door on it. Oh, literally. Pressure in it. Still got the door on it. Hey, that's what these little things are we're finding. They're not things off cars, look. Yeah, we're, the, not, we're not going that one, look. We've not got in it. Get the crowbar. Oh, look, there's some treasure in there. Oh! <laughs> get, the, get the bar. Go get the crowbar. Oh, wait, we're in. We're in. We're in. Get the crowbar. We're going to need the crowbar. That's what we've used that for. <laughs> These little dials we're finding, look. They're not off, um... Oh, content. <laughs> money, money, money. Hey, if that's full of purple, it's funny. It's full of money. What's that? Oh, nothing in it. Grab that. I want a Rolex. Since you can't know. Obviously. Oh, yeah. For that. The documents. Okay. Well, if there's if there's anything in here. HSBC. We'll have to report this if it's. Uh, don't give anybody's name out. No name, no name. No. Documents. Also. <laughs> If there's a 50 grand in here, we'll, we'll go off. Whoa! Oh dear. Wallet. Oh god, look at all the England notes in it, look. Oh no, it's full of money. Oh, it's full. Oh dear. I know it says America, that does look. It's a dollar bill, yeah, look. Yeah, it's American dollar. $20, look. There's a 20 here, look. 20 America. So that's dollars, but he's got yeah. all his cars. Let's have a look who it is. Might know him. Can you imagine? Oh, it expired in 2004, so it's been in there since 2004. This looks like this is completely empty. You never find one that's been robbed recently. Just watch yourself. You want to tip this out? Yeah. I just got a phone call. This is uh, what looks like a calculator. 
Good God, W.H. Smith. That's uh, a calculator, I think. Yeah, they're all the same person. That's a calculator. That's the safe door. Yeah. Robert wasn't very happy when he lost his safe. Mm. Robert, if you're watching, we've found your safe. Mm. Well, look like uh, hard What's drives it? here. What are these? Floppy disks, are they? Oh, no. What's this? That's that not money, is it? No. Oh, it's a <gasps> shotgun certificate. No! Shotgun certificate. That's his shotgun certificate. It is, yeah. <gasps> oh, dear. That's his shotgun certificate, look. Get some leaves, look. That's his. Hey, what? Well, if they nicked the guns as well. You we probably did. Yeah, that's the shotgun certificate. And you can see this. Oh. Get some you won't clean it with them gloves. That is in its Nottinghamshire place, I believe. That'd be Lincolnshire. Yeah, that's Nottinghamshire. We'll clean this and just have it's a look. Lincolnshire now. That then. needs probably reporting. Well, what if there's a firearm certificate as well? What's this? These are like old fashioned uh, computer discs. Bradford and Dingley. Something in this. Something in this. Saving account. Is he from Bradford? in the bag, what's in the bag? That feels heavy. Oh, but it might be bullets. It could be gold. But it could be, it could be money, like. It could be gold. Nah. It feels heavy. Imagine. Oh! Unless it's just water. No, there's something in that. Oh, they're the bolts of the safe. <laughs> that's, that's, that's why that just... <laughs> that's just my oh, luck. there's the key. Oh, they might be. The, they might be the. They might have been the keys to his gun cabinet. That's just my luck. <laughs> yeah, Dad. They've had all the gold. Unfortunately for them. Oh. <gasps> Dad. Oh dear. <laughs> it's full of money. It's full of money. <gasps> no. <gasps> It's full! Find some Australian money, there's about 10 grand there. This is full of plastic notes. They're all plastic notes, look, oh they're all 50s. 50, 50 there's about 10 grand there. Wow. No! <laughs> Send me a find a safe with but what, how much would there be there in 50s? There's 20 50s in a thousand. And there's about 50 there. There's about two and a half grand. Good lord. I think we're going to have to report this because there's a shotgun certificate in the safe. There's a shotgun certificate. There's and about uh, two and a half, three grand. There's a wallet if not more. full of money and these are plastic now. These are all plastic. They're all are they hundreds? Hundreds. Or hundreds. Like, hundreds and fifties yeah. and hundreds. But what, what, what currency is it? Australian. These are Australian one hundred dollar bills. Australia. Crikey. One hundreds. Wow. Hundred dollars. Hundred pound. Hundred dollars. And they're, every two of them is hundred. <laughs> <laughs> Loads of money. <laughs> really? I'm in the jackpot here. Put that in the back pocket. Actually, no. It's a bit muddy. Is there anything else? Is there any gold? Oh. Go through it carefully because it could be anything in there. No. No way. Have I? I think I better bag these up for evidence. Hey, how much is in that? This is probably. We'll have to 
all this bagging up. Oh, this is just sick. Okay, so first time we found a, 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 a safe with contents. Uh, yeah. As it happens, it's full of money, so and, and contains somebody's shotgun certificate, which means they probably took the shotguns as well. So yeah, it's quite sad because this belongs to somebody, obviously. So we'll try and get uh, the, mon the money back to them. We'll report this and uh, see where we go from there. So we've counted this and oh, I think it's come to 2,530 American, uh, not American, Australian, uh, whatever they deal in. Um, but that is, is it dollars? Australian dollars. Australian dollars. Two and a half thousand. Two and a half thousand in a bit. Australian dollars. <laughs> <laughs> two and a half grand in a safe. I think we've hit the jackpot today. <laughs> no one's ever found two and a half thousand pound in a safe. No. And the plastic. And the plastic. Hey, get get a um, get a bucket, fill it full of water. <laughs> Give them a water. Just th this is what you call money money laundering. <laughs> <laughs> laundering. <laughs> Washing the money. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bags of cash. It's a shame it's not ours. <laughs> hey, we might get a little bit of a reward for finding it. Good all that. Look at them all. They're all good as well, look. Two and a half thousand dollars. I'm smiling today. <laughs> hundreds plus. Oh, they're hundreds. How many hundreds is Thank you. You're welcome. You soaked me. What's that? That's a spoon. Spoon. That looks like a brick, but it's magnetic. <laughs> a ball, Dad, a ball. It sticks. Got We've got a lot of things actually. Oh, oh, got got the safe. Safe. Right, you're coming up absolutely genuine. Or is it one of them rat boys? Right, that is a bomb. I'm joking. I don't know what that is. I think that's some sort of hydraulic thing. I've got on here, I've got a pen lid. And in the safe, I've got a lot of slot. Any money in it? Mm, this well. time? Just tip it home. Just a lot of slot. Good tin, that. Ching, ching. No. No. Hey, dear. Safe box. Has it been prized out? It's quite a nice one, isn't it? Prized out. I put a lock on the last one. I've got a lock. <laughs> you can buy them cam locks off eBay. They're only about two quid. You can recycle that. I might do. No. I might. Don't take any more rubbish home. That's actually quite a clean safe. Nice. Yeah. Oh. That first, is it? What's that then, Joe? This is this is leather. It's got something heavy in it. I think it's a lot. Ah, it's a bag. Yeah, it's somebody's um, like lock bag. It's got a quite a considerably heavy lock on that. Nice. Nice bike wheel. Oh, what's that? There's a little buckle. Aha, what's that? Come out, look. Perfume oh. bottle. That's a bit tough, nice. Look at that. George. Hang on, Dad. Great. Is that a perfume bottle? Looks like it. Still got the contents in there. I don't, I don't know whether I dare take the top off and smell it. Oh, it's coming up. Does it unscrew? Oh no, it's a little push pop. 
Oh, that smells nice. <laughs> it smells a lot better than the holy water. It smells a lot better than the. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Oh, not this lot. Oh, you'll smell lovely now, mate. Oh, what have you done? <laughs> no! <laughs> that smells good. That is really expensive. That is. You're looking with your my dad and not a friend because I'd have put you in. I'm not even joking. What did you tip that on me for? That smells lovely. That's a really expensive perfume. I couldn't care less what it is. And you've tipped that on my head. That's Lady, that's lady G's Christmas present. It's going in the bag, that is. I've got this theory that this, this is a really old perfume bottle that came out of that Victorian safe, so... It does actually smell really nice. But it's probably poison. And uh, tip that on my head. No, it smells. It's, it's perfume. Go on, tip some on yourself. Then. It smells. It smells nice. It's, uh, it's as good as the day it was thrown in there. <laughs> if anybody knows anything about this, it's quite a distinctive shaped bottle with a unusual top stopper. And it's still got half full contents because I tipped the other half on George. Why do you tip it on me? Now I've found the world's largest pizza paddle. And as you can see, it's a nice big, for a nice big, super sized pizza. Look at that. I'd say that's quite good. <laughs> Come back, camera lady. That's right back, otherwise we need the river. There's no fault of mine. Old bike wheel. Somebody's fishing that. So we've just got this. Um, I think it's the front of a fire. I'm not too sure. Uh, like that. It's like probably that way, like the front of a fire grate. Like this is like the air intake holes. Quite interesting. This one's heavy. Oh yeah. That's a splitting wedge for splitting logs. That's a great find. I like things like this because I can clean them up and and reuse them. Oh, got another box. What's in the box? Oh, no money this time. Just an empty cash box. Another one. Oh yeah, Motorola. They don't make them like that anymore. Old phone. I'll go in the bin. I believe that is a power bank of some sort. It says Seagate expansion portable drive. Oh, it's a portable drive. At least it was. Yeah. Got a screwdriver. You want to ride it, it's a lot better than walking. <laughs> <laughs> That's a hanging basket uh, bracket. Right, so this is just an example of how good the online magnets evolution is. So not only is it stuck to a safe door, or whatever door that is, like really strong, right? It's picked up 
the best part of 500 nails. I don't know where they've come from, but like. They look alright, don't they? <laughs> Galvanised nails. How am, I gonna get, how am I gonna get them off? piece of uh, iron work like a floaty lee we've been attached to something it's cast obviously broken off something still quite nice it'd be nice if it had been whole whatever it was Like shotgun barrel. Nah, it's a bar, that, isn't it? No, I think that's a shotgun barrel. Not that sure. I think it is. It does sound a bit. It does. It's good quality steel, that is. That's a piece of a sawn off shotgun barrel, in my opinion. Is it though? 20 bore caliber. No, look. Oh, golly. Actually, it could be. You don't normally get a tube that's that higher quality and thick. Like it's thick walled. It's about right, isn't it? Yeah. But it's thick. It's just that, that mm, mm. Yeah. In my opinion, that's a piece of a shotgun. Oh, this looks nice. Or it would have been. I thought it was part of an urn, but I think actually it's, I think actually it's part of a, an old fire grate. That would have been really quite ornate. It's got fleur de lis in the middle. I don't know if you can see that. would have been off but there's some securing loop on there where it would have been screwed to maybe a wall or something oh. not really sure what that is Moved up to the other side of the bridge now. It's uh, it's still about the same depth. It's not very deep this river, but um, yeah, there's some stuff coming out of here. I can't believe it. Well, these are bits of one. <laughs> that weighs heavy. Look at that. Well, you tell me what all that was. It's I would, I would imagine it was some sort of massive. Drain great, great, I should say, because this is broken off here and here. That's heavy. Just found this, another piece of the fire. It's like there's some fancy. I found an hammer. 
fancy pattern in there. Dad. Oh, yeah. It's an old uh, ball peen hammer. We'll keep that one. Another piece of the fancy fire. Poor, poor fancy fire has been smashed up. Yeah. It's a shame. More nails than I don't know what that is. I think it might be a wing mirror. At least it, there's seven years of a bad look right there. I've got a bike lock. Um, I don't know how that's in there because it hasn't been cut. Um, that's a good thing for the day. Uh, keep the vibe alive. Get the sausages on, George. substantial handle so real like old tools it's proper craftsman's tools you know this is this is obviously made out of proper piece of wood it's a piece of oak or something god i've got a knife <laughs> wow. another big knife I don't know why it's been painted orange. Is it orange? Orange. Would it have been orange out of the factory? Probably. I think it kills somebody without one plus. AR Cook. Yeah. Some weapon. Do this without knocking the bridge down. Usually, when you tap the rust, most of it falls off to reveal a very nice hammer. Another nice hammer. I don't know whether somebody's lost the toolbox or whether it was used as a you know, give it under your jacket and. It as a weapon. So we find loads of these, loads of hammers. We've uh, got quite a massive amount of coins. What have you got, Dad? This roof is absolutely full in, of nails in places. I'll use some of these at, at Christmas time when I make my Christmas reindeers. Use them for the antlers. Good lord. I think, I think this is probably something off a bike. Not really sure. I'm not, I'm not a biker. I'm not a push biker. <laughs> right, so we've got the whole Oh, works on here. Look, we've got a bike lock. Ooh. A bike lock that's obviously been cut. Otherwise, it wouldn't be in there. Uh, and we've got a load of wire. It's like strands of metal, iron wire. I've just found a lock. Wonder what that was locking up when it got. I've got a window wiper. It actually looks quite, that actually might be off a retro car, Dad. Yeah, Austin Allegro. Austin Allegro. 
I've never seen a, a metal window wiper, like a chrome one. Back when they used to chrome a lot of cars. Yeah. When was that? Before the your 60s time? 60s and 70s. It's an Austin Allegro. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's probably a fire grate. <laughs> Second one, that's probably about the fire grate. Would that dude put in front of our fire, George? Which one? The one in the shed. Actually, it might be, yeah. No, I don't think so. I think we've got a toolbox down there. I've just found this rather nice hammer. What have you got, Dad? Uh, yeah, that's quite nice. And I've got a padlock. Another one. That's a piece of wire, isn't it? Oh, George. What? I found a Chinese puzzle. A man sized one. There you go, mate. I think I've got the other half, but it's for a giant. Right, it's almost dark now. We've found another one of the monkey puzzles. <laughs> I didn't realise George has found the other one. Oh, well, they're locked together. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what? With a vivid imagination, you could turn that into a star. I don't think so. Come on, George, work it out. You need to catch I'm up. I'm freezing. I, I, I haven't even took this glove off to put the other end of the coat in. I stink of perfume because you sprinkled it over my head like holy water. I, mean, I didn't particularly want to get christened today by That some... perfume is probably really expensive. It's, it's from the 18th century or something. I don't back care in what time. period it's from. And it smelled really nice. Next time I find some of that holy water, it's going over your head. It's going to Lady G. She, she's claimed that one. Lady G. Okay. This is the downside to this job. We've, uh, we have to cart this uh, about 500 metres back to the road, so. More than uh, that. <laughs> we're doing the best. <laughs> Go. One wheel is going one way and one is going the other, so it's how like it's. Okay, so we've fished into the dark. We've had a great day today. We're, it's been absolutely fantastic. I don't think we've ever found so much in one day. Behind us we have a massive heap of scrap, there must be over a tonne of scrap behind us. Uh, we've put a scrap notice on it so it's going to be picked up uh, hopefully tomorrow. Uh, what can I say, we've found a safe full of cash with hundred dollar bills. It didn't get better than that. <laughs> and they're all plastic. And they're all plastic, so uh, we're going to have to report this uh, because it's obviously a scene of crime. So. I can say that there was a lot of money there and uh, we'll do the best thing we can and that's reported so hope you've enjoyed the video and uh, I just want to say that the online magnets magnets done it again today it's uh, been a fantastic both magnet them. both of them have performed superb the beast and the evolution yeah I found the uh, I found the safe with the with the beast so I told George he should have had the other way around and then he might have found the safe you see so anyway <laughs> Oh well. <laughs> Never mind mate. There'll be another one in there. You've got a bit of catching up to do now lad. So uh, until the next one, take care and we'll see you soon. Oh.